What's going on you guys? I hope you're all having a great morning, afternoon, or evening, whenever you may be watching this video. So I made a poll on my Instagram story asking some video ideas that you guys would like to see. You guys always really enjoy whenever we install new parts on my 86. We actually have a giant box sitting over here in the background. So as you guys can tell, we just had the truck drop off this giant package. This is my first time seeing it. And I know you guys probably can tell already by the title of the video what is actually inside here, but I'm gonna be getting it taken out of the box for the first time. So as you guys can see, we got a full carbon fiber hood for my GR86. Now before I actually unravel the hood so I can show you guys how it looks, this is all thanks to Extreme Online Store. You may have heard me mention that company's name before, which I actually have their front lip installed on my GR86 already. I absolutely love the way it looks and I've had zero issues with it, which is why I absolutely love their products. You guys have been asking to see some big changes on the 86 recently and I figured this right here should do just that. Enough talk, I know you guys are super excited just as much as I am to see how this thing gonna look. So with that being said, here is the new carbon fiber hood. Alright you guys, so first impressions, I, I, I'm honestly lost for words. This thing looks absolutely beautiful. So what we're gonna go ahead and do now is I'm actually gonna come over to the 86 so I can show you guys how you get the factory hood removed. And it may be a little bit different for me just because I actually have aftermarket hood struts on my car. But the process should be relatively simple and it shouldn't only take around five or 10 minutes to get the factory hood taken off. So first things first, what we're gonna go ahead and do is obviously get the hood opened up. And I'm pretty sure to take off the factory hood, it's as simple as just taking off a few bolts. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these, which I'm pretty sure is a 12. Yep, 12 millimeter. Just get these few bolts taken off and then go ahead and get the factory hood removed. The first thing that we can do before we can get the hood installed is actually there's a few Phillips head screws that we need to remove on both sides. So now that we got these four Phillips head screws removed, we can actually take these wooden pieces and to put them off to the side. You'll see that there's actually this latch right here. I'm gonna go ahead and get this zip tie cut. That way we can put this into the holes right here. There's actually one, two holes, and there's two nuts that you can screw down to actually latch it in place. So I'm pretty sure I got the latch all fully tightened down. At least I'm pretty sure I did. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead now, just grab the carbon fiber hood just so I can take it over to the 86 and get it put on. So we got the hood fully mounted onto the car. I actually had to install my factory hood prop because I couldn't use my hood struts anymore. Now that everything's fully in place, I'm gonna go ahead and drop the hood. Let's see how everything looks. Before I fully close the hood, if you guys have heard, carbon fiber parts don't always fit the best or have the best fitment. If you look around, oh, I have a little piece of tape still right there. Hold on, wait, wait give me a sec. <laughs> If you guys look at the gap, there's not pretty much the exact same gap as there was on the factory hood. And keep in mind, there is more of a gap than there should be in the front because it is not closed all the way. But if you look at the spacing all around, it's the exact same on all sides, which is really, really nice. I'm gonna go ahead now and try and fully latch it down, just like so. What I'm gonna go ahead and do now that we got everything fully installed is I actually got this window banner thrown on. I'm gonna go ahead and take the car out and go grab some photos and videos of how the new carbon fiber hood looks. So with that being said, let's go ahead and grab the 86, pull it out onto the driveway so that way we can go ahead and get it all started up. Alright you guys, so we just made it to this spot right now where I can grab some photos and videos to have the new carbon fiber hood turned out on the 86. I'm personally in love with the whole design and everything like that. 
Like I said, I don't know if I mentioned it or not before in the video, but I plan in the future to get this entire front part of it painted Neptune blue to kind of match the color of the car. And then leaving this inside kind of insert right here with all the vents, all carbon fiber. I know you guys are probably tired of hearing me talk. So with that being said, let's go ahead and cut into the cinematics. Now that you guys have seen how the new carbon fiber hood looks, let me know down in the comments below what you think. I just wanted to give a massive shout out and thank you again to Extreme Online Store for sending over this carbon fiber hood for me to test out and review to show you guys how it looks on my 86. If you guys are interested in any sort of parts for your 86 or BRZ, make sure you guys go check out the links down in the description below to see if they have any parts that you may be interested in. With that being said, if you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure you give it a like down below. It helps me out so much. Subscribe if you guys haven't already. That way you can stay up to date on all the content that I make with my 86, just like this. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Peace.